no testing has overtaken you that is not common to everyone. God is faithful, and he will not let you be tested beyond your strength, but with the testing he will also provide a way out so that you'll be able to endure it. 1 Corinthians 10, 13, from the New No testing has overtaken you that is not common to everyone. God is faithful, and he will not let you be tested beyond your strength, but with the testing he will also provide a way out so that you'll be able to endure it. 1 Corinthians 10, 13, from the New Revised Standard Version. When I have a decision to make, but I don't know even where to begin, I can get so frustrated. How about you? Thank you for joining me, and in this guided meditation, I'm going to help you to remember when you were stumped, but you found a way forward. Or maybe the truth is that the way forward found you. You see, one of God's great promises is that we can endure and there is a way out. Really. God's gift of meditation often helps us to find that new way of looking at things. So, as you practice this, of remembering the truth, that even though you feel like, oh, this will never end, it does. And even though we may think, I'll never be happy again, we are. If you find this meditation helpful, why don't you subscribe to my channel? There's lots of good stuff on it. And if a person comes to you while you're doing this, give them a call. Give them a call. Share the link. Hey, it's all good stuff. And love shared has great power. Now, let's start. Many of us dread that this time, that this time the problem is, that this time the problem is just going to be too much. This is the time. We've actually felt that way dozens of times before, but we, we kind of forget, don't we? The feeling is a feeling. It is not a predictor of what's going to happen. The fact that we have been stuck and become unstuck over and over again, that's the truth upon which, the rock upon which to build our life. It's God's gift to you. If you'll but take it and use it. The feeling is the feeling. It does not predict the outcome. Isn't that simple? So relax, we're going to practice remembering that truth so you can do it when you need it. Just relax, you might want to close your eyes. Oh, get, oh, take a deep breath and just let it all out. Oh, let your shoulders down. Just breathe a couple more times and let your brain slow down. I remember a time that you were stuck. Lord, when, do I, when was I stuck and I just didn't know how to get out? Let yourself remember. Was it with a child that wouldn't listen? A boss that didn't like you? A friend who decided to, to get upset and you weren't sure how to 
restore the friendship. Oh, there are lots of ways of being stuck in life. Sometimes we even feel like the car.